Hi there guys, it's Lovey Boy 2603 here. I hope you're all keeping safe and doing well. And yeah, welcome back to my channel. This is only my second upload since football got suspended back in March, but it's just during the COVID period there's been a lot going on, there's been a lot of uncertainty and I've just not really found football that important nor found uploading to this channel very important. But this Saturday the Scottish Premiership will return. Unfortunately there'll be no fans in ground so it won't be the same. But Scottish football's back so I'm gonna start uploading this channel again. I just want to quickly say that my videos will take a new format during the closed door period. Basically, each weekend after every round of fixtures has been played, I'm going to just review the results and talk about what that means for the table and my personal opinions and predictions for the following games. So yeah, videos are going to be slightly different for the current period, but yeah, I hope you enjoy it and get into these predictions for the 2020-21 season, a huge season for Scottish football, particularly surrounding the number 10. So, as you can see here are my predictions for the bottom four of the SPL. So, I believe Ross County will come 12. Now, last season Ross County had a very quiet start in the way that they weren't contenders to go down, but they also weren't contenders for top six. But, as the weeks and months went on, they did start to drop down the table, and there's a thing called the second season syndrome. I do believe Ross County will get hit by that and get relegated this season. As for 10th and 11th, I don't think there's going to be a lot, but I think Hamilton will edge St Mirren. See, Hamilton Aki seem to survive every year and just like just hang on in the last day. So for that reason, I've Hamilton 10th, St Mirren 11th. St Mirren could surprise me. They're a team that have the capabilities of pushing for top six, but I do believe they'll come 11th this season. For St Johnson, I believe it'll be a very quiet season for them. And they'll take that, to be honest. I think they'll be too low to be considered top six contenders, but too high to be in a relegation battle. So from 5th to 8th, I've, there's a few controversial ones in here, but I've put Kilmarnock 8th. Alex Dyer is in charge for the, from the start this time and I do believe that will let him put his spin on Kamarnock because he kind of inherited the team last year so it'll be interesting to see what he does with the team and I think Kamarnock will be a solid team this season but I do think they will fall a few places short at the top six. As for seventh I've went with my team Livingston. We came fifth last year, absolute phenomenal season for the Lions but there's speculation in the papers with Lyndon Dykes leaving and not only do I think, I think we'll still be a very good team this season, but I do believe teams like Hibs and Dundee United will be stronger, hence why I've put us 7th. As for 6th, it's Premiership new boys Dundee United. I mean, Dundee United, historically are a big team, but I don't think they'll have it all their own way going into the Premiership, but I do believe over the course of the season they will have enough class to get into the top 6 and come 6th. 5th place, I've went with Hibernian. Hibs, I mean, a lot of folk will ignore this, Hibs didn't have the best of seasons last year, but it did get masked with the situation Hearts were in, but I believe Hibs will come back a lot stronger this year and secure 5th place. Just to create a bit of suspense, I've kind of broke this bit into uh, 2 lots of 2 instead of just being 1 lot of 4. Now, there's no surprise with my top 2 are, but what way have I put them, find out in a couple of minutes, but Aberdeen, Mullerwell, I've predicted Mullerwell to come 4th of this season, Aberdeen to come 3rd. That's pretty much a mirror image of how these two teams came last season. I believe over the course both of them will have a very tight battle for 3rd, but... I do believe this year Aberdeen will slightly edge Mullerwell. So yeah, I predict it's going to be the historic season that Scottish football will see 10 in a row. I do believe Celtic will get the better Rangers through the course of the season. Now, Rangers will be out to stop Celtic this season at all costs. And I'll admit, for the last few seasons I've predicted Celtic to win each league. But the last two new year old firms it looked like Rangers were going to win the league and it was no different this year. I actually thought Rangers were going to stop Celtic this year but they fell away after the winter break. This year there's no winter break so I wonder if that will work in Rangers' favour but I do believe over the course of the season Celtic will just show that little bit more class to get 10 in a row. So yeah guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video of me predicting the outcome of the Scottish Premiership. If you disagree with any of my predictions I would be interested to hear them so comment them down below and yeah, this format of video is not the most entertaining, I know, I'm sorry, but this is kind of how the videos are going to be whilst football's behind closed doors. Anyway guys, stay safe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.